Hi everyone. Today I am going to tell you about the script menu of the laser object. So let's begin. Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Create laser. Go to its script menu. By modifying the values of the color property, you can change the color of both the laser body as well as the laser beam. This property is composed of four values representing red, green, blue and transparency. Change the values and see how it affects the color of the laser. The beam became invisible because its color is similar to the background now. Let's make the body invisible now. Revisible it now. Let's change the background color so that we can see the blue beam of the laser. You can also change the color of the laser using this property. Let's check it and see if it changes the color of the laser. The property cutter is used to make the laser beam function as a cutter or knife. Its value is false now. So it is unable to cut any object. Now make its value to true. You can see it is now cutting the rectangle into pieces. This entity ID is unique. It cannot be changed. The fade dist property in Algudu's laser object script menu is used to control the distance at which the laser beam will fade out. The default value is 300, which means that the laser beam will fade out at a distance of 300 units. You can increase or decrease this value to change the distance at which the laser beam fades out. For example, if you set the fade dist property to 10, the laser beam will fade out at a distance of 10 units. This means that the laser beam will be fully visible at distances of up to 10 units, but it will start to fade out at distances greater than 10 units. The fade disk property is a useful way to control the look of your laser beams. By adjusting the fade disk property, you can make your laser beams appear more realistic or more stylized. The rotation property in Algudu's laser object script menu is used to control the rotation of the laser beam. The default value is 0, which means that the laser beam will not be rotated. You can increase or decrease this value to rotate the laser beam. This property controls whether the body of the laser is visible or not. If it is true, the laser body is visible, otherwise it is invisible. The higher the value of the size, the bigger the size of the laser and its beam. Velocity controls the speed of light of the laser beam. I don't think you will be able to change the speed of light in your real life. But here in Algudu, you can reduce the speed of the laser light. If you reduce the speed of light, the gravity will overcome and will attract the light towards the ground. Time to live controls the life of the laser. It's infinity, that is, it will not die unless you exit Algudu or close the current scene or delete the laser manually. However, if you put its value as 5, the laser will delete automatically after 5 seconds. I hope you understand today's lesson. Thanks for watching and bye.